Flood has continued to ravage communities in some parts of Bielsa State, rendering residents homeless. The situation has forced the state government to order the closure of schools to avert danger. In most communities visited by correspondent Jesse Ese, some natives who are now homeless called for help from relevant agencies of government. The towns mostly hit by the flood are the riverine areas situated along the Forcados and Non Rivers. But the state government is hopeful of being able to address this menace in the coming years if it gets the needed support from the federal government. Flood is still coming up. This place you see now is just a temporary uh, habitation of people, the temporary place for the people to, to, to occupy. But the flood is still coming up and we don't know where to run to. So we need total re-evacuation re re of our people from this very place they are now. There is no place to stay. That is why people are just standing on the roadside. So even after this today, to, or even all these places will wet. No means of income, no food, even both plantain, yam, cassava, mm -hmm. everything has wet now. Mm -hmm. Time to time, when this situation will come now, they will only come and video, tell us to explain how things are co uh, going on with us. But at the end of the time now, we will not see anything. We are, as a state government, calling on the federal government, and the federal agencies, the NEMA, the Nala Delta Ministry, the NDDC, to aid joint forces with the state government in providing succor for these affected communities and persons. As this flood comes, it comes with ailments and so on. Therefore, uh, there are some areas that need high grounds. We have also identified those areas in all these communities. So the state government cannot, on its own, meet the demands of this uh, flood disaster. The issue of flooding as a problem to our people and the advice from the Minister of Works and Infrastructure led to the construction of concrete barriers to prevent communities from flooding. And from the inspection we carried out, you are all witnesses to read. OD community for now is still protected. Sampao community is protected. The water that came to Sampao community is from the back, where culverts are provided during the construction of the roads. And so we've noted it, and we will see what we'll do to ensure that next year we will be able to correct all that. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.